you talked about being acidic and that that eventually leads to, to, to death. What are some of the dangers along the way, though, I mean, of being too acidic? What, what are some of the steps that our body goes through? Well, there's seven steps or what I call seven stages. The first one is I'm tired. Okay. If you're saying that, you're in stage one or step one, acidosis. The second one is irritation or sensitivities. You may have like allergies or skin outbreaks, acne. This is stage two acidosis or step two. Stage three is when you start or constantly clearing your throat or coughing where the body is actually neutralizing acids or buffering acids producing a sticky mucus. Mm. This is stage three acidosis or step three. Step four is when you're in an inflammatory state. You cannot be in an inflammatory state or have pain without acid. Stage five is when the acid that you should be eliminating becomes solidified. This is when it builds up on the walls of the arteries and sets the stage for a stroke. So solidification. Mm -hmm. so most people that are in a stage of solidification can check that by testing their cholesterol because cholesterol increases in the presence of acidity to buffer excess acid to protect the organs that sustain life. It's not that cholesterol is bad, it's that it's trying to protect you against your poor acidic lifestyle and dietary choices. Step six is ulcerations. And finally, step seven is degeneration. Now you've been diagnosed with cancer or diabetes or a degenerative or osteoporosis, a degenerative condition that's the reflection of what you're eating, what you're drinking, what you're thinking.